Hello, welcome to another Animal Crossing video. Kind of like the last video that I did. I wanted to simulate some stuff using my Animal Crossing characters. And in this case, it's specifically uh, Drag Race. So we have the cast here, Petrie, Ioni, Judy, Marshall, Maple, Lolly, Apple, Crince, and Octavian, Tom Nook, Isabel, and Dom. Those are the people on my island. We're excluding the Nook twins because they're little kids. Okay, let's... Wow. Okay, so the first week, Prancer won the mini challenge. I know for a fact it was not the reading challenge because he could not read to save his life. Can't do this. So it's probably like a Glamazon Prime. What is it called? The one where they're on a budget? Not balling on a budget. Well, oh, and I forgot to say, even though I said it in my last video, I'm stealing this whole idea from Angry Coconut. Like, you guys, like, I don't even have to say it, you already know. So let's just continue. Let's get out that out of the way, because if I could be a quarter as funny and entertaining as Viz is, then that would be amazing. Okay, so the queens will do outfits with items inspired by past drag race. Ooh, I love that. So Tom Nook, Marshall, and Dom slayed the challenge. I wonder who they dressed up as. Ioni, Maple, Octavian, Apple, Krantz, and Isabel had a great performance. Judy, Petrie, and Lolly had a good performance. So no one had like a bad performance. Right. And I didn't put any of like the bells and whistles and like double sachets or whatever. So based on tonight's performance, Tom Nook, Lolly, Marshall, Petrie, Dom, and Judy, you represent the, the tops and bottoms of this week. Ioni, Maple, Octavian, Apple. Why do I keep skipping Apple's name when I'm reading it? Cranston, Isabel, you are safe. Ladies, I have made some decisions. I'm like using my hand to block the screen. Tom Nook, congratulations. You're the winner of today's challenge. I randomized their skills, by the way. So like the only one that I looked at their skills were Marshall. But that's all I'm going to say. Because there's high numbers. Or were there? I don't know. Well, it says he's safe. Lolly, Petrie, and Judy are the bottoms of the week. And Judy is safe. So that means Lolly and Petrie are going to be up for an elimination already. I know Petrie had like one of her skills that were at zero, but the main challenge was like fashion. I don't remember if it was fashion that she was zero at. <laughs> it's fashion. Is it fa <laughs> wait, what is it fashion? <laughs> it's fashion. <laughs> but like, maybe if it was like a speech challenge, she would do better because she's like a nerd. Lolly, I, Lolly's just happy to be here, I feel. So they sing, she works hard for the money by Donna Summer. I mean, I guess Lolly do be working hard. And Peachy, Peachy's a woman in STEM, so I, I don't know why. Maybe she's like, you know what, guys? I sacrificed my performance this week so I can get back home and, and continue the research, the cure for Alzheimer's or something. And quick thing, I used to be a neuroscience major in school, and I used to do some research about Alzheimer's. So don't talk to me about that anymore. Anyways, Apple won the mini challenge, as she should. Gagatrandra. What kind of challenge Apple would win? Maybe like that challenge, you know, where they all had to do, I forgot what season it was, but they all had to do a specific type of cake. I'm not sure to look to that. I know that was the main challenge, but I'm going to pretend that like this is this challenge. And Apple had to dress up as, had an outfit inspired by like a fruit from the Animal Crossing Island. And of course she had Apple, so she won. You see, I'm so creative. Wow. I am so powerful. My mind, oh. The Queens will improvise in a new Bossy Rossi episode. Dom, Judy, Ioni, Maple had a great performance. You know, I could see definitely see Dom and Ioni and Judy being like, you know, good actress. Maple, she's like a secret threat. Everyone else, whatever, had a good performance. <laughs> so Cranston, Isabel, and Lolly had a bad performance. Not even like good. Ooh, so like no one slayed. Okay. All these people are the tops and bottoms of the week. Maple, Marshall, Apple, Octavian, Tom Nook are safe. I'm glad Apple's safe. She won the mini challenge too. That's good. You know, I only care about her. Okay, I care about Maple too. She apparently did really good in this challenge. I should have known. Of course, Dom is going to come in and be start winning everything. I guess this is competitive spirit in him. Like, kind of like in the Hunger Games video where he was like in the top four and he had like the most kills or like was tied most so g and ioni are safe good my sparkly eye queens that killed each other i think ioni killed judy too i guess you guys made up in this lifetime let's see 
who's safe. Cranston is safe, of course, because, like, I could not imagine him being, like, the best actor or taking it too seriously. Like, he was probably, like, goofing a little bit. He's, he's there. Like, he's passionate about this, so he wants to continue. So, like, good thing he's safe. Okay, so Lolly and Isabel are up for elimination. Let's see what song they do. They do Conqueror by Estelle. You know, I saw this coming. I saw that Lolly was going to sashay away as soon as I saw she was in the bottom two again. Isabel, I did not expect her to really do that badly because she's Isabel and she's literally good at everything. But who knows? Dom, I think Dom is definitely winning. So Judy won the mini challenge. It was definitely the reading challenge. I will read you to filth. This week was definitely the reading challenge. She read everyone to filth. She actually became a librarian and had a job as a librarian and like kind of like prepared herself for this moment. Actually, she told me so. Oh, the Rusical. Okay. It's all about past drag race contestants. Cranston and Isabel had a great performance. Isabel did a full 180. So, Dula Peep. Please ignore that. Um, she did a full 180 and she is in the top now and everybody else had a good performance. So no one did exceptionally bad, which is good. You know, it means we're weeding out all the other performers and keeping the best of the best, you know, or the goodest of the goodest. Now for their runway, the theme is Phoenix. Uh, the band or what? Dom, Marshall, and Isabel slayed the runways. Ioni and Octavian had a good runway. Okay. And everyone else... At a good runway. I'm putting my money on Dom or Isabel for the top. Okay, see, Dom and Isabel are both in there, so they're top. Tom Nook has fallen far to the bottom. That's crazy. He literally won the first week and he's like, never mind. Isabel Condragula. I told you she did a full 180. And that's crazy. Okay, so Marshall and Cranston are safe. Good job. Cranston, I love you. Tom Nook, Maple, and Dom are the bottom of the week. Dom, oh, how the mighty have fallen. You really thought you ate? <laughs> Give me that fucking plate. Tops two weeks in a row, plus that win, and now you're just safe. Because you're in the bottom. That's probably why they saved him. Maple and Tom Nook. So, like, Maple apparently did really well in the acting challenge last week or the week before. So, like, what's good, Maple? Two of hearts. Oh, my gosh. I hate how it just shows both at, at the same time. Um, like, there's no build-up. Like, three, two, one. But, like, Maple definitely was like, oh, snap. Like, I need to, like, step it up if I'm really serious about this. And I can't keep putting others before myself. And I'm going to slay this. And she did. Tom Nook. Oh, she passed away? Money can't get you out of- well. So, next challenge. I think this could be the- the puppet challenge. I love that challenge where they have to make over puppets of each other. I know it's a large cast, so maybe- or it's a large cast still. Like, not many girls have been eliminated, so maybe they wouldn't do that because apparently it might- I've noticed that they've stuck to those challenges when there's less girls. Is like, are like puppets too expensive or something like that? Oh my god, Snatch Game. Okay, I, I'm gonna do this thing where I'm gonna give them, like, the first celebrity that pops up in my head. Marshall is Pete Davidson. Ioni is Marilyn Monroe. Dom is Caitlyn Jenner. Cranston. Michael Rappaport. Cancel culture and the- Isabel, Lady Gaga. Yes, Gaga, you look so good. Judy was RuPaul. Maple, Rihanna, <laughs> not the flop. I'm gonna say that Octavian was Kanye West. He was trying to be be recent with the times, but obviously, like f Kanye. All the homies hate Kanye, and if they don't, they're not my homie. Maybe Apple was Kim, and then they like had an argument or something. The theme is two in one. Apple and Maple slayed the runway. Now that could really help Maple. She had a good performance. She's recovering from being the bottom two and she slayed. So that's like good in her favor. I guess we'll see in the little chart later. But Apple, girl, I'm glad because you flopped and you've just been saved and you slayed the runway. Two in one. I mean, Apple is your name and it's also a fruit, that pun. And so Maple too. So I guess that's what, 
That's what helped motivate them and propel them to do their best in this. Cranston, Isabel, Marshall, Octavian, Judy, and Dom had a great runway. Now, Dom had a great performance and he had a great runway, but he was in the bottom last week. But he has that win, so let's keep this all in mind when we're looking at all this. And, like, I couldn't be asked to put pictures for them or, like, try to figure it out. Isabel, Maple, and Cranston are safe. Of course, I told you Dom was going to win. Well, I didn't say that verbatim, but I did hint to the fact that I thought that he would win, possibly. Marshall and Ioni are safe. That's good. I'm glad. Oh, my God. Apple, please be safe. Please be safe. Apple safe. Yes. Hallelujah. It was definitely her runway that saved her. Party in the USA. I love that song. Okay. I think Judy probably thought that she got, that she was going to be good this week. You know, because she has them in the bottom. She's been coasting safe. She, like, knows all the lyrics for Party in the USA, but, like, doesn't really know them. And Octavian was, like, studying his little tentacles off to try to win this lip sync. Because he knew that he f flopped in the Snatch Game, so he went and he studied hard. The thing about Dom is, like, he hasn't been safe. He's either just been in the top or one. But then he has, he was in the bottom ones. Marshall is doing pretty good, too. Three highs. So Dom won the mini challenge. Okay. Octavian slayed the challenge. Redemption. See, I told you he got the little kick in his tentacles and he's like, I gotta go. Ione, Isabel, Marshall, Grant, blah, 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 had a great performance. Apple and Maple had a good performance. Now Apple, you better not end up at the bottom. Oh, they had a dance number about drag race. Apple, you're Apple's like a pop star, but she doesn't dance as well, so that's probably why. Maple doesn't usually dance, so the theme is trains. Ioni, Cranston, and Apple slayed the runway because you already know Cranston is one of those kids who's like, I like twins. Or was one of those. Everybody else had a good runway. Octavian, come on. You're slacking. Maple too. I think Maple's going to be in the bottom. Marshall and Cranston are safe. Okay. Ioni? That's mad random. Unless I just skimmed over her name. She like is humble, stays in her lane, helps other people. Doesn't like a lot of attention on her, so then she can come out of nowhere and boom. Who the hell is this crazy ass drag queen? Bam! I knew it. So, 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 so Dom does not want to decide what he wants to do with his life. Either you're good or you're bad, honey. Is it worth, like, taking all the risk? He's, he's always been spontaneous. Maybe he's been playing it really risky. Maybe in this case it will, but I don't want Maple to go home either. But, like, according to the record, like, if you take that into consideration, I mean, I know usually you do that during All-Stars where they vote. Maybe Rue will take that into consideration. Not S&M. That's probably why Maple had to sashay away. She's probably uncomfortable singing that song. Honestly, I'd be a little uncomfortable publicly saying those words out of my mouth. I don't want anyone to know that I know what that song is about or the words in those songs. But Maple, come on. It's your whole dream. You're gonna throw it away because of that, but I know I know she can have a successful spin-off. She's definitely gonna be on All Stars. Yeah, Dom is like, I don't know what his deal is. Ioni and Marshall, I think, are tied so far. Okay, Octavian won the mini challenge. It's me, Jesse Ari. Maybe it was like you have to like there's a bunch of stuff and you have to grab as much as you could, make like a super cool wig. And because he has a lot of tentacles, he grabbed a lot of cool stuff and was able to work twice as fast as everyone else. And he also had a good performance. Of course, the top comedians talking about crime are men. First of all, Octavian and Cranston. Cranston is a criminal in the best way possible. Isabel, Ioni, Dom, and Apple had a good performance and Marshall had a bad performance. Well, he's not really funny. The theme is fish. You mean like fish or like fish? You know, maybe it's both. Cranston and Ioni slayed the runway. Cranston probably made some sort of pun about the dual meaning of fish in this context. Ioni probably just looked amazing and sparkly like a mermaid. A lot of greens and teals and ugh, amazing. Octavian, Dom, Apple, Marshall had a great runway. Isabel had a good runway. Oof. Ioni's the only safe one this week. That means Isabel and Apple are in the bottom. Cranston is the winner. I told you he was a criminal. He speaks from experience. And he also, like, probably did, like, a cool, like, fish, like, outfit. He probably, like, I don't know. 
Granted, this is probably eaten a lot of fish in his day as like a crane. He probably like did like a whole like super specific artistic detailed look. Octavian and Isabel are safe, but they're on the top. So that's amazing. Love that for Octavian, some redemption and Apple safe again. Apple, this is like the third time that you've been in the bottom. You were saved probably because you're a fan favorite. And by fan, I mean me. Marshall and Dom. See, I told you, this is crazy. Dom is either in the top or in the bottom. And Marshall has been doing pretty consistently good. This is first time in the bottom and the fact that he's up for elimination. So they're gonna sing Head to Toe by Lisa Lisa and Colt Jam. No way, dude. He must have slayed the shir out of that lip sync. Oh. 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 He has had a more turbulent go around. So like, I'm a, I'm kind of surprised. Octavian won another mini. This is probably the one that they go out in the middle of the street and they gotta like interview people or talk to people or prank people or something. Octavian has a way with words sometimes. I could see him convincing somebody to join a pyramid scheme. And he slayed the challenge. They will make everyday people their drag sisters. Oh, this is the makeover challenge. Okay. Cranston went from the top to the bottom, but like, honestly, it's okay. I think, I think he'll survive. Everybody else in the middle coasting Dom barely is still here by the seat of his pants and of course octavian won i knew he would win for having these this whole conquered week it's all octavians and like i think this will give him the momentum to keep going he started off as an underdog i think he i can see him in the top okay apple i guess slay at this point like make up your mind like friend to friend sister to sister come on cranston nor because Cranston won last week and he nor they're singing not myself tonight by Christina Aguilera Cranston Shantae you stay damn I only they were both at the top last week nobody else okay we have lost a great one in Ioni and for Cranston being the bottom so so far to recap everybody but Apple has a win she's been in the bottom four times Dom has a the most wins but he also has the most bottom twos i think as of now isabel is doing the best based off the statistical statistics here oh i just realized design improv rusical snatch game dance comedy makeover they still they need a singing challenge of course cranston won the mini challenge queens will act in an 80s inspired film about cancel culture cranston won the mini challenge but then he just had a good performance Hopefully that mini challenge will help elevate him and keep him out of the bottom. Dom, my friend, it's not looking good for you. It's not love. It, Nari, you gonna go home? It's not funny. Apple, what? Apple won. She wasn't even in the top. They see that she's trying, I guess. Of course, Dom and Grant are enough for elimination. Oh, damn. I forgot that it wouldn't say who the top and bottom was. It was just gonna go straight. Good thing because I, I would have been jump scared. Dom, I told you, I told your ass that if you were going to keep this up, this was going to happen to you. And then what happened? Exactly what I told you was going to happen. You still have a future. Maybe you'll have like a viral meme. It's going to turn into a sound effect or something. Stan Twitter. Some people are going to yass. So we're at the top four right now. Isabel, Apple, Octavian, and Cranston. Yeah, because she has four highs, one win, one bottom. And then Apple has one win, four lows. Confused. Cranston just... Two weeks in a row, bro. And then he won the mini challenge again. What's that about? So, ooh, it's the ball. Three looks are black and white, rainbow, and, ooh, rainbow, and flowers. Cranston is definitely gonna go home, I think. It's not what I wanna see. Um, as a parent, wouldn't you just like want more for your son? Like the fact that I, I tolerate having a son and he's the best son ever. But why would he do this to me? Sorry, my mom and your mode is on. They have another look. Isabel and Cranston slayed the runway. Okay, hopefully he, so he won the mini challenge. He had a good performance here and he slayed the runway. So maybe he's not going to lose. So take back literally everything I said before. Redact it. The only person who did consistently well is Isabel. So, but, but that's what I expected. And then Apple won. Yeah, this is definitely, there's some, some, something fishy going on here and i'm and i'm not just talking about the drag how come apple won isabel's at the bottom and she did consistently good in both in both facets of the main challenge she was doing the best and suddenly she's at the bottom Ooh, 
I just skipped way too quickly over that. I can't see who got eliminated, so I'm just gonna look. Even though he did really well, he still lost. Isn't that crazy? You never know. That's why you always gotta be bringing it. Because, I mean, yeah, you would have known because he's been the bottom consistently and they've just been saving him. Isabel, Octavian, and Apple will perform or participate in a music video for RuPaul's newest single. Oh, I really like that song, Smile. So maybe it's that one. The theme is best drag y'all you already know everybody that exists already know that apple would have turned it out for this you know we know isabel like i knew but i did not expect but i am not surprised because of her past in this game her track record so far and octavian just had a bad runway so Octavian really said, let me kick it into high gear so I can do super well throughout their competition after he, he was in the bottom, only to have a bad runway in the finale. You really couldn't have turned it out for best drag. That's like hard, sure, but it's also easy because you just have to wear your favorite thing for it to be good. Oh, I mean, neither of them slayed. They were good. Maybe the judges are just being too harsh. Ladies, it's next time to... What? I can't even read. Covering the screen with my hand. That's probably why I can't read. It says, ladies, it's time to decide the next drag superstar. I don't want to look. Isabel, I'm sorry, my dear, but it's not your time. No way. Anyone should be in the top two. I would have expected it to be Isabel and Apple. Apple and Octavian, this is your last chance to prove yourself. It's your time to lip sync for the crowd. Or something like that. I should do RuPaul and Snatch Game. Of course, the lip sync song is Bohemian Rhapsody by Queen. I, th I think Octavian slipped somebody a check so they could put that song. Because that's definitely a boomer song, okay? It's not cool. People think it's cool because they think it's rock music. It's a cool song, okay? I'm just being gatekeepy, but... Anyways, what was I saying? Oh my god, okay. Now there's finally the decision. Now I can cover it with my hand. I'm scared. Who do you guys think it would be? Pause this for two minutes and write down who you think it's going to be with an explanation. And I just accidentally looked at the screen because I forgot. And the next superstar is Apple. You know what? I think I like projected my favoritism onto the computer screen. And the FBI person watching me through the computer screen was like, let's get our best hackers to go into this game and make Apple. Because I'm not saying that she not, did not deserve to win and does not deserve to win, because she does. She deserves to win every single competition she's in. But like, as a scientist, as a woman in STEM, I can't ignore the data, you know? I guess Apple really just was a fan favorite, and they were scared that a fan favorite would be quote unquote robbed again. I mean, like, cause a whole other controversy, which that was messed up. If you guys were one of the people who and said that Raven should have won. No one had more than two wins, but Apple had two wins in a row at like a, a very crucial part in the competition. So that definitely like boosted her. Well, that was it. And that was so fun. I am so proud of Apple. Did you guys think Apple would win? I did not. I thought that Isabel or Dom was going to win. They were slaying, first of all. Second of all, they almost won Hunger Games. So I thought like that same spirit was there. Then again, Apple was in the top of Hunger Games. Too. And she was really coasting by. Kind of like she did for like the first couple weeks in this game. Leave a comment down below. Let me know if I should try this game again with other villagers or like people in real life, or if I should try a different simulator game. This was so fun and I had so much fun with the Hunger Games simulator. I might do it again. Thank you so much for watching. Yeah, quick note for my anniversary, the week after, Joel and I are gonna be in London. I might vlog, I might not, but I mean, if you thought my upload schedule was unreliable and, and scarce before, well, here you go, another reason. Thank you so much for watching. Let me stop ramp. Bye. It's a whole thing. Like, I am not IT, honey. I don't know if, like, do I look like, like...